Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope that you're all doing fantastic. I am so sorry again that I have been gone for so long. My grandmother actually had to go back to the hospital. We finally got her home today though, so that is very good news. She's doing much better, a little bit stronger. Her heart's doing better. She's home now, so we are very happy to have her. Tomorrow is Easter, so happy Easter everybody. I hope that you have a wonderful day surrounded by all of your loved ones. I'm so happy to have my grandmother home for that. I love Easter. It's one of my favorites. So that just makes it so much better now that she's home with us. So looking forward to tomorrow being a fantastic day. I hope that that goes the same for all of you. Today I have a massive Dollar Tree haul because I finally went yesterday when I knew my grandma was going to be coming home and I knew we had the all clear. I went to Dollar Tree and I hit a jackpot. I don't know if it's because I hadn't been able to go in a week or so, but I found some fantastic stuff. So I'm really excited to show you guys. It's going to be a lot. So sit back, grab yourself a drink. I also have a card that I wanted to show you and I have a gift. This whole time I was supposed to be doing a collab with um, a pocket letter, spring pocket letter collab with um, Sharon over at From Cheap to Chic and it just didn't work out because of my grandmother being in the hospital. So hopefully we'll be doing that soon. But she so kindly sent me, a, probably it's been at least a week now, these adorable little gnome bees in the mail and I just had to share them with you. Aren't they just about the cutest things you've ever seen? How cute are they? Their little wings and they do light up. They're a little light up. And then this one. I just love their little antenna sticking up. I think that they're so cute. Sharon, I love these so much. Thank you again. I know that I already told you thank you, but thank you again. I love these so, so much. They are so adorable. Can't wait to use them as decoration. Yeah, you guys, I wasn't even, even able to do an Easter background. I literally didn't get anything up in my house. I have not prepared for Easter. Last night at about midnight, when I got home, I ran around the house and put up a few bunnies and a banner and um, put out a hand towel and some things in the restroom, but I didn't get anything else put out. Nothing that I bought, hardly anything that I, I wasn't able to use anything. It was just, a, it's been a really rough time in my family, so we didn't get any preparation done. So we're just kind of flying by the seat of our pants. You'll see a lot of that in here, <laughs> but um, yeah. So another person that I was supposed to meet during all of this, Bonnie and I were supposed to get together again and go shopping. She was supposed to come here to my hometown and it wasn't able to happen because my grandma was back in the hospital. So hopefully that will be happening within the next couple of weeks, but I do have a card from her. So I wanted to share it with you guys. I haven't opened it yet. It's an Easter card. It's in this really cute thing. She has washi, of course, so cute. And then she has these really cute foam stickers on the back. I should have opened it or pre-opened it, but I didn't. All right, let's see. Oh, oh, how cute. Oh, it has confetti in it. Oh, they're cute. They're little, I dropped most of them, but they're little bunnies and little eggs. Little bunnies and eggs. How cute are those? So those were in it as well. So it says, for my friend. God knew that spring would bring a smile to our hearts and more importantly, that a savior would bring hope to our world. Thanking him for the beauty of spring, the joy and hope of Jesus and the blessing you are to me. Happy Easter. To you and your family, girly, hope you have a wonderful, blessed Easter season. So grateful to have you in my life. XOXO Bonnie. And this is Bonnie from Bonds Bond, bon Bonds Halls. If you guys are not following her, go follow her. She is amazing. So this is the front of this beautiful card. Isn't that so pretty? And then inside she has so many cute little stickers. Isn't that so cute? Oh, I love it so much. Thank you girl so much. I look forward to rescheduling our day together because I was really excited for that. And I have scoped out my best Dollar Trees that I'm gonna take you to. So super excited for that. But guys, let's go ahead and get into the haul. Um, yeah, it's a massive one, so strap in. All right, let's see. I'm gonna start with some of the boring stuff because let's just get it out of the way first. I picked up another bubble mailer. I grabbed this um, 
This is from an old trip. Some of this stuff is from a like, really old trip that I didn't get to film because of everything that happened. So this is part of it. I thought I would be sending my pocket letter in this that I was going to do with Sharon and it didn't happen. So I bought this one. So hopefully I will be sending a pocket letter in the future to her in this, but grab that for that and it didn't end up working out. Actually, all of this kind of boring stuff was from that trip. Most of my fun stuff I found yesterday. I picked up three boxes of these. Um, they are actually the triple soft with aloe. So the Scotties, um, you get 54 in here, but they're three ply, they're three layers. These are absolutely amazing. If you have any sort of allergies or if you get a cold or anything like that, these are amazing because they're super soft really really soft i have chronic allergies and asthma and these are a savior so love those grabbed oops like i said oh hitting everything like i said i grabbed a few boxes of that so have those i picked up another thing of the freshen up flushable moist wipes this is called a refill and travel pack they don't have the actual pack to refill so this is just like a travel pack you get 30 wipes in here and um yeah we do not flush these that's not the best but um they are nice to have so grabbed a package of those i needed some um baggies so i picked up one of the sure fresh um these are the gallon bags you get 13 in here they're the double seal so i picked up one of those and then I did pick up the Glad ones in this size because they had the 10 bags. Um, these are the Freezer Quart, and you get 10 in there. So I went ahead and picked them up. I picked up a thing of the designer paper plates. These are the smaller ones. I usually like the ones with the red packaging, but they didn't have any of those. So I went ahead and grabbed these. In that package, there's only 10. In this package, you get 14. So I went ahead and picked that up. I like that it's kind of a springy pattern. I think that that's cute. So grabbed those. And then guys, I don't know how this happened. I bought one of these yesterday, but I thought we didn't have any. I bought some in my last haul. So now we have a plethora of napkins, but these are my favorite ones from there. So I have three packages of these and they are the Home Store Premium Napkins. They are actually two ply napkins and you get 50 in here. These are comparable to the um, Vanity Fair napkins that you'll get at like Target or Walmart that are a ton more money and they are just, just as nice. So yeah, these are my favorites from there. Love them so much. I know you don't get as many, but you don't have to use that many. You can use one, it's, it's fantastic, they're great. All right, let's see, I picked up some food items. I picked up some more rock stars. I picked up four actually, but I have one here to show you. These are the 12, 12 fluid ounces. I like them because they're a little bit smaller. And you can't find them at a better price than $1.25. And then I found this, which I was really excited about. It is the Victor Allen's Coffee, nothing new. It's not a new thing. The iced latte, a chilled coffee drink in vanilla, they have these all the time, but they're usually much smaller. And it says up here, it contains 15% more as compared to their 9.5 fluid ounce can. So yeah, they're just making them bigger. And the can's kind of prettier, so yeah. I was really excited about that. I love these so much. These are absolutely delicious. I I was drinking the little ones. You guys have seen those in my hauls. I'm sorry, my nose is itching me today. But you guys have seen these in my hauls in the smaller version. Well, I was super excited when I saw the bigger version. I already drank one today. It is delicious. I picked up my, myself two, so I have one more left, but love those. My goodness, I'm getting tongue twied. Twied. Tongue tied today, obviously. Obviously, it's my first video back. It's going to be a little rough. Sorry, guys. <laughs> All right, let's see. I have so much candy, but let's start with this. I have found another one of the 40% more, so I picked it up. Whenever I see them with the 40% more, I grab it. Um, it's just the Sunny D and Tangy Original. I love this stuff, so I always pick it up when I see it with the bonus. Okay, I have so much candy. Most of this is for gifts. So I picked up one of these. They're the Haribo Zing Sour Streamers. I've never seen these, but I don't go down the candy aisle every time. They seemed kind of new to me. I don't know. But they're little belts, like little sour belts. So figured I would give those to someone. And then I got a few Easter candies. I'll show those first. Okay. I picked up this one, which is the Charms Blow Pop Minis. Um, you get watermelon, blue raz, cherry, and sour apple, and I just love the, the package. I thought it was so cute with the colors. 
So I grabbed that. And then I picked up these um, Oliver's white chocolatey pretzel rods. You get two of them in here. You guys said these were fantastic at Christmas time. I never found them for that, but I found them for Easter. So I'm super excited. So I grabbed those. I picked up a thing of Peeps for my grandmother because they're her favorite. And since she's going to be home, I figured we need a little treat for her for tomorrow. So you get five chicks in here. And I just grabbed the classic yellow. I picked up a thing of the Sour Patch Kids bunnies. Um, 3.1 ounces. So yeah, little bunnies. Super cute. And then that's all of the Easter candy. But I also picked up one of these Charms Fluffy Stuff Watermelon Cotton Candy. It says it's new. I don't know. I love cotton candy, but this is actually for a gift. But super, super happy to have found it. It's a cute little thing. And then I picked up these, these um, Tootsie Roll Fruities um, in Watermelon Fruit Flavored Chewy Candy. So I bought a package of that. And you get um, 5.8. Oh, seven ounces in here so quite a few but cute packaging I love the green and the pink together and then I also picked up a package of the new Warheads ooze chews ropes um, you get watermelon blue raspberry and green apple it's 0.3 ounces it's eight filled ropes that you get in here so grabbed those as well all right, that is all of the human food. I got some dog treats though. I picked up three more of the Deli um, Stick Turkey for Dogs by Molly's Market. Chloe absolutely loves these, so it's fun for a special little treat. So I picked up three for her to give her for Easter. And then I also picked up this to give to the puppy, and I already gave her one, but I'm saving it for when the puppy's over at my house. So these are the little Greenbrier Kennel Club oven baked triple flavor twists with chicken. Real chicken is the number one ingredient, no artificial flavors, long lasting chews. You get six in here. They're just little rods for them to chew on. The puppy across the street loves these, loves these so much. Chloe, not so much. So they don't fight over them at all. So whenever the puppy comes over, she gets a little treat. All right, let's see. Where do I want to go next? Let me get some of this stuff out of the way so I have places to put things because, like I said, this is one of my bigger hauls. Oh, last week I did have to run in because I was getting my nails done finally for Easter. I hadn't gotten them done in weeks and weeks. And so I ran and got them done, but I ran and got them done between the hospital and work, and I didn't have time to grab shoes. So I ran into Dollar Tree and picked up a pair of the flip-flops because I had seen these. I wanted them anyways, and I thought, hmm, I'll run into Dollar Tree and I'll pick these up. So I grabbed them. So they are the little beach scene flip-flops. I love them so much. I think they're so cute. The strap is like a yellow glitter. So, so cute. I think these flip-flops are so cute. Are they well-made? Are they going to last me more than a summer? No, but they're going to be super cute this summer. So I'm really excited for these. Also, I, I haven't even told you guys this yet. I'm going to Hawaii. I'm going to Hawaii in May. I wasn't supposed to go. It's a trip that my mom and my aunt take my grandma on with her sisters every year. It's annual. I don't usually get to go, but because my grandmother has been sick and everything's been happening, this year I get to go with them. So I am going to go to Hawaii with them. We're hoping, we're hoping we get to go. We're hoping she's strong enough to get over there, but um, we're hoping she still gets to go because we have a timeshare. She can just sit and relax on the balcony and you know, she doesn't have to do anything once we get over there as long as we have her strong enough to travel. So yeah, so super excited. So I'll be able to take my new flip flops for the beach. So excited. All right. I picked up two more Easter things. Um, I grabbed this little bunny for Chloe. I kept trying to find the troll ones, the stuffed trolls for Easter. Never found them. I found them for Christmas, I found them for Valentine's Day, but I could not find them for Easter ever. So I went ahead and just grabbed her a little bunny and I thought this little one laying on its stomach was cute, with the little cotton tail, and I love the color of pink that it is. It's not too like bright of a pink. And then it has cute little um, patterns inside. It looks like little bunnies and carrots and eggs. So super cute. So that will also go with her little treats as part of her Easter. And then I picked up a thing of the Dudley's coloring cups. This is what I'm talking about, last minute shopping. I haven't even dyed eggs. 
but my nieces and nephew are coming over, so we're gonna be hiding eggs. So I've got a dye a dozen tonight. So yeah, so I bought one of the things. Um, you get five coloring cups, five coloring tablets, and one egg dipper in here. I already have my eggs, so I figured I just needed these. So I will be dyeing eggs as soon as I'm done with this video, actually, because it is getting late. It's almost dark, and I have a lot that I need to do today. And I already worked, so it's it's been a day. Um, okay, where else do I want to go next? Because I have got some really cool stuff. Let's do toys. I picked up this, which is not new. I've seen it around, but I picked it up to have for tomorrow for my nieces and nephew because I bought them the little bubble guns from Dollar Tree. So I figured that this would be perfect to have for them to refill it and stuff like that and have fun with while they're here. So I grabbed this big, huge thing. It's the Swan Smiling Bubbles Scented Bubble Solution. Refill your favorite bubble machines and toys. You get 67.6 fluid ounces, two liters of bubbles. So I was super excited that they still had this and that it hadn't sold out or anything because I should have gotten it when they first had it, but I didn't. And so I'm super excited they had it back because that is going to be perfect for their bubble guns for probably the whole summer. Okay, I found some new toys. Okay, these were new to me and and I think they're so cute. Okay, they're wild creatures, land, air, and sea. They're wall walking bugs. They include one bug and one swatter. So I picked up the one that is the ladybug and it has a little leaf swatter. And what it looks like is that you attach it and then fling it and then watch it crawl down the wall. You can see those instructions back there. Yeah, so I don't know. But aren't they cute? And then I also picked up the one that is the bumblebee with the sunflower. How cute is that? Aren't these cute? I just thought they were darling and so interesting. These would be cute in the Easter basket because they're spring related, but didn't think about that in time. And I already have the kids Easter baskets made, but, um, but these are super cute. I actually got them for a gift. So I'm going to be giving these to my friend's kids, but love those. Thought those were real cute. I'm just throwing things on the floor now, running out of room. All right. I found some new fidgets. I don't know if these were new or if I just finally started looking at the fidgets. I don't know, but I found this one. It's the Orb Sensory Fidget Popper, and it's one of those little double ones, whatever, that you can rotate. So I picked up three different colors for my best friend's girls, my nieces for my best friend. And then, because I'm giving them, you know, I got that orb trade your, your fidgets game. And then I'm getting them a bunch of fidgets to put with it. And that's going to be their Easter, even though it's going to be after Easter whenever I finally get to see them. But yeah, so I picked up those ones. And then I found these ones. And these are definitely new. I had not seen these before. And they are called an orb sensory octo bubble. So it's this big popper. Looks like kind of like an octopus. So how cute is that? So yeah, I picked up that in blue and in pink and in purple. So, so excited about all these. And then the last thing that I found for their little gift is these DIY RD Wacky Tracks. 45 degree rotating, free splicing, ages five plus, it looked like a fidget to me. I don't know. I think you can attach them and make them, you know, into different shapes and attach multiple ones. I don't know. I just picked up three because I figured they could use it as a fidget or they can attach them and, and play whatever they wanted to do. So I picked up three in different colors. So I got the pink and white. I got the pink and blue. If you guys know what these are, if you guys have gotten these before, if you've seen them or you know what they're supposed to be, like, is it something where they're going to need multiple ones and this isn't going to be that cool of a thing? Or is it something where they can just do whatever they want to do with it? Anyways, the pink and the blue and the blue and the orange. So yeah, picked those up. So we will see, but yeah, let me know if you guys have used those or you know of kids that have used those. Let me know what those are, if they work, if they're just fidgets, if I can use them as just fidgets, because that's what I'm thinking of doing. All right, I needed a bathroom cleaner, so I picked up this Comet Classic Foam Bath Cleaner with Bleach, removes dirt and soap scum buildup. 
You get 24 fluid ounces in here. I've used this in the past, really liked it, so I went ahead and grabbed it again. Where do I want to go now? Let's see. Let's do some of this stuff. I picked up a thing, another eyeglass cord. I had gotten one of these previous, um, last summer because I was traveling again and I wanted it to hold my mask. These work to hold masks if you just attach them to the little loops down here. They work perfectly. So I went ahead and picked up a fancy one so that I could have a new one for Hawaii because now I have a reason to buy the things that I do. So I'm super excited. I found this really pretty, oh, you know what? Let me take it out so you guys can see it out of the packaging. It's really pretty. I was super excited with it and it's kind of cool because Hawaii, you know, pearls. So I figured. So it's just this pearl, like pearl and bead. It's not cute. So I grabbed that one this time to hang my mask from while I'm flying. So super excited about that. All right, I got a few Crafter Square things and some, some like sticker items. I picked up, this is brand new to me and it was in a really cool new display. You guys, they have this amazing nautical display section that I was floored floored by this stuff that they had. If I decorated in nautical, I would have bought the entire, literally the entire thing. This would be even longer than it's already going to be. This is going to be like a 40 and especially if I talk so much during it. And I'm so sorry. I haven't been able to talk to you guys in a little while. So I'm, I've got a lot to say, but, um, it was amazing. If you guys go, if you guys, if you guys do nautical decor, if you love that kind of a thing, go, go run, run. Amazing stuff. In that same section, they had this Crafter Square mason jar chalkboard sign. It has the twine on the back so you can hang it if you want to or you can just stand it up. It has the white on it so that you can see the outline. Isn't it so cute? It does have a little raffia bow. I might change that bow out and do my own like twine bow or something like that, but isn't that cute? I thought that it would be cute if you wrap the twine around and do a really cute bow and then make a little sign. I don't know, how cute is that? So, so excited about that. And then these were new as well. And I don't even know what to call these. They're little wood chip pieces and they come in this cute little container, but they have multiple different ones. You have a crown, a cloud, a butterfly, a mushroom, a flower, a bird, a leaf, a heart, and an owl. They had two different kinds. The other kind had um, an anchor, Maybe an anchor is all that I remember. It had an anchor. It had a few other things in it, like maybe a house. I don't know, a couple of things. I didn't need both, so I picked out the one that I would use the most of, so I grabbed this one, but isn't that cute? They're not very big, if you can see them compared to my fingernails. They're not going to be very big, but aren't those going to be perfect for crafts or for pocket letters or something like that, which I also bought these for, for something fun, for pocket letters or for filler for cards or something. They're calling it Vase Filler from Floral Garden. And it's just these really pretty gemstones. They're like silver on one side and then the gemstone on the other. It's not beautiful. So yeah, picked up those to use as something. I got a few things of stickers. I picked up this one and it is this, um, it's by Jot. You get 20 pieces in here. They're laser cut and they just reminded me of my childhood. So I had to grab them because how fun are these? I mean, even just the style of sticker, the way that they've done it in this, you know, I, does this remind you of your childhood, anybody else? I mean, come on, honestly, even the style of sticker, I don't know how to say it, but like laser, I don't, that's not what I would say, but you know, like the holographic, but the way that it is, it's like very, um, not Lisa Frank, but just so many things were in this style. Anyways, I'm going to quit babbling. Sorry guys, but how cute is this? Just totally girly, so fun. So grabbed that one and then I did pick up this one, which also just reminds me of the 90s it's, or 80s. It's totally like a neon sign related. These are glitter. You get 85 in here and it's one of those that you get three different kinds. So you have this. How cute is that? I love these. I love these so much. I should have gotten more than one of these because I love them so much. Like how cute are these, the neon sign ones? And then you get a sticker, I mean a letter sheet. Aren't those so cute? I just, I thought they were very well done. Very, very well done. And then I found these. They're also by Greenbrier. They're called Rainbow Foil Tech Stickers. You get 25 in here. 
that's what the packaging looks like. I figured we'd open it so that I could show you guys because I don't know. It's another thing that they have just in the packaging. So I figured we could open it and I could show Okay. Okay, so it's just sticker sheets. Okay, so it's just two sticker sheets that you get. So you get this one with some larger ones and they're holographic. You get a crown, a couple of coffees. That's why I picked this, this set. I think it told you, it shows you at the bottom here, if you go to buy it, it shows you down here what you're gonna get. I just didn't realize how big they were gonna be or what they were gonna look like, so I wanted to show you guys, but this is what they look like. And then this one you get, it says seize the day, focus on the good, spread kindness. You also get like a boba tea, a tiger, a little balloon dog. So cute, that's actually really cute. So yeah, they had two different kinds, two different designs. I just picked up one because I didn't know what it was gonna be, but that's real cute. All right, I picked up two more of the little car coasters, but these ones I got for a gift and they have little pineapples on them. So I love mine. I put them in my car. I think they're working. Um, I've used car coasters in the past and I really like them. And these ones are working just fine. So yeah, got those for a gift as well. Let's see. I picked up this for myself for my car just because I loved it. I loved it so much. I love that it's made out of yarn. I like that it looks like yarn this time. The other one was made out of string that was um, different. I don't know how to explain it, but it was string instead of yarn. This one's actual yarn. And it's an 11 inch dream catcher. And it's just this cute moon one with the little beads and then the beads on the bottom. I got that to put in my car. Love that. So cute. They had it in different colors. I think they had a pink and then they might have had like a bright blue. The, the pink was really bright too. I just really like the white. I thought that color was cool. All right. And then I picked up another one of these tech cases for a gift as well. And it's the coffee one. Little coffee hearts. I love these little cases. They can be used for a multitude of things, medications, um, coin purse, uh, just to keep cords in. It's They're really handy, really, really handy. So grabbed another one of those. I picked up a couple things of ribbon just to save because I found them and I was super excited because my cousin loves sloths. You guys know that. So I found two things of this really cute sloth ribbon on the green background. You get nine feet in here but how cute so i figured i would use it on something like a gift of his and the upcoming gift or something all right for outside i picked up one of these um pick mosquito repelling coils you get four coils in here they repel mosquitoes um for outdoor use they burn for five to seven hours so yeah picked up a package of those because during the summer we love to grill and eat outside and so we need these so picked up those for that and then I had to grab these because I thought they were just so cute they're the garden collection little steak solar steak lights but they're little flamingos I just think they're so dang cute so I picked up just two of them to have made sure they had their tabs in them and made sure they had their actual steak part but yeah how cute are they I just think they're so fun for the yard okay let's see here we're getting there, guys. We're getting there. I have a lot. I am sorry. It's a long one. All right. This is from the Toolbench Hardware, and I grabbed it because I thought it was cool to have, and I'm always needing a hex key, and I never can find one, you know, when you always need it. And so this isn't these, these, what is, poof, this is an eight-piece foldable hex key set. So you get all of those sizes of hex keys and they're all on here. So you just pull them out and use them. How handy is that? So I'll grab that to put into our little tool drawer, drawer, drawer. Anyways, I also picked up a gift bag because I need to wrap up a gift and I just thought this was absolutely stunning. So I picked it up. I just, I mean, I love the navy blue background. I love the florals that they've chosen to use like the wildflowers. I love the glitter and on just a few of them, you know, it's not that much. And then the back is just matte and then the sides just continue. Isn't that beautiful? And then you just get white straps, but isn't that gorgeous? I just thought that was beautiful. So I picked that up to put a gift in. Oh my gosh, I am running out of places to put stuff. All right, I picked up a few decorations and decor type things. All right, I grabbed this for a gift as well, this little angel. 
She's just the little pink one that's holding the heart. I just loved her. I thought she was really pretty and I just wanted to give her as a gift to someone special. I picked up two kind of Mother's Day things because they had them already. I grabbed this really cute little trinket tray that says, love you mom, in the heart to give to my mom. And then I picked up this one that says, grandmas are the greatest blessing to give to my grandmother. How cute. All right, got those to save for Mother's Day. I picked up two candles for gifts. I grabbed these, they're really cute little jars. So I picked up the one in Sweet Peach. And they're just kind of a little jar candle. Not cute jars. And I picked up the one in Strawberry Shortcake, which is like a milky glass. You can see the difference, clear and milk glass. Really pretty, they smell really good. This one smells just like strawberry ice cream. So the person I'm giving it to is gonna love it. All right. Then I picked up this really cute little picture and I, it's, they had it in three different colors, like a terracotta color, a blue, and then this one. And it's like a gradient and it's, it's very subtle on the pink one because you can hardly see the light pink, but you guys can kind of see it there. It's a very subtle gradient, like white to light pink to darker pink, like a mauve color. But isn't that really cute, this cute little picture? I thought how cute would that be with some with some florals in it or something or just using it as decor on my shelves or something like that or in my bedroom. It's just really pretty. In person, you can really see the gradient a little bit better and it's really, really pretty. So if you guys see these in person at your stores, they're beautiful. And then I was so excited, you guys. I found the Crafter Square Wood Bead Garland. You don't get a lot at all, you don't, you don't get a lot, but I went ahead and picked them up because I never saw them before. So I picked up one, two, I had three originally and then I went back and got a fourth just because they had enough. And I was like, why not? If I'm gonna make a garland, I need to make it long. I'm so sorry, my nose is driving me crazy. But if I'm gonna make a garland, I'm gonna wanna make it long. So why not grab four? So I went ahead and picked up four and I am over the moon about it, you guys. So excited, so excited that they had them at my store. All right, I also picked up these to put into a vase that I have in my bedroom that I needed something to go in and I just thought these were absolutely gorgeous and they're the magnolias. And they're like the beige to pink on the inside. Aren't they pretty? I just think they're gorgeous. So I picked up just a couple of those to put into a little vase and a bundle in my bedroom. I think they're going to match real pretty because my bedroom is kind of pink and um, and beige and kind of, so I thought that would be really pretty. I'm getting my room ready for my room tour, so I had a few finishing touches that I needed to do, and I haven't been doing any work on it in the past month or so since my grandma's been sick. So yeah, grabbed those for that project. Okay guys, we're on Healthy Beauty and we're at the home stretch, and thank you so much to those of you that had stuck with me. Thank you so much. All right, let me do some of the boring stuff in health and beauty first. I picked up this to take to Hawaii. I've taken this traveling before. I love it. It's the perfect size. The deodorant works really nicely. It's the Dial Professional Antiperspirant and Deodorant in Crystal Breeze. You get 1.5 fluid ounces in here. And yeah, it's just the perfect one for travel. And it actually works. I like this a lot. So pick that up to go on vacation with. I picked up a thing of the Colgate Enamel Health Whitening, 62% more free, um, anti-cavity fluoride, fluoride toothpaste, just picked up a thing of that. I grabbed a thing of Crest Scope, these little no water needed little mini brushes, the little toothbrushes to have. I grabbed these to put into my work bag just in case like for those days that I work a double and I eat and something's garlicky or something, you know, sometimes you need these. So pick those up. I also picked up a thing of hand sanitizer. It's the Extra Care. This is 70% alcohol hand sanitizer with moisturizers and vitamin E on the go, purse or pocket size. It's two fluid ounces. I figured this would be perfect for the trip, for to keep in my purse, for the airport, for the airplane. I could spray down my tray and my, you know, my thing. I could spray down stuff. So yeah, figured that would be perfect. Okay, let's see, do I have anything else? Oh yes, one more boring thing. Oh, oh two more, two more boring things. <laughs> I picked up a thing of the Plackers High Performance Back Teeth Angle to easily attack the back. These little dental floss picks, 35, they're angled, so they make it a little bit easier if you have a hard time getting, like I have a really small um, 
mouth and so I have a hard time getting back there. So these are perfect for that. So I picked up a package of those. And then um, the last boring thing I picked up was this set of um, three Colgate um, toothbrushes. They're soft. Um, buy two, get one free. Yeah. So I thought it was a great deal for three. So picked those up. Needed those, so that was perfect. All right, now let's get into some of the more fun stuff. This isn't new, but I went ahead and picked it up because I wanted to give it a try. It's the pumice version of the Be Pure um, head for the little... Um, cleansing brush thing that we have that I have I don't know if all of you have it but that I love um and so I figured I would try this because I have um you know for summer I mean you got to be sandal ready so I figured why not try this yeah softens and smooths rust dry rough dry skin calluses on your feet so yeah we will give that a try I will let you guys know I picked these up for my cousin. Um, I do an Easter like kind of hunt for him. And so I grabbed these to be part of it. And it is the Global Beauty Care, the Pink Sugar Lip Scrub. I love, love the lip scrub. The only thing I don't like is the lip um, mask. The lip mask is not good, in my opinion. In my opinion, it made my lips worse. But I didn't love it, but you guys might really like it. I don't know. Didn't work for me. But I love, love, love the scrub. I use it almost every single day. It's just really, really nice. So I picked up a scrub for him. And to go with it, I picked up the Lip Scrubber by Sassy and Chic. The little tool. So I figured that would be perfect to put together and use. I picked up three more of these. I had grabbed them before, but I picked up three more because I wanted to give one to my aunt, one to my mom, and then keep one for myself. So these are the Intensive Eye Cucumber Under Eye Pads Anti-Recall Serum Soothing 15-Minute Eye Therapy Eases Puffiness and Swelling for All Skin Types. And you get five in here. So five pairs of under eye masks. So yeah, picked those up to give to my mom and my aunt tomorrow for Easter. And also to then have one for myself because I'm running low on my under eye pads. And you know that can never happen because I love those way too much. All right, I picked up a couple of Bolero, a few Bolero things I grabbed. These are all for gifts. This one is the body wash. It's watermelon and beach rose. Um, it says a hydrating, vitamin-rich blend of watermelon and refreshing beach rose. You get 6.8 fluid ounces in here. I just think the packaging is really pretty, so I grabbed that. And then I grabbed the After Shower Whipped Body Cream, watermelon and beach rose as well. And this one you get five fluid ounces. And then I picked up the Body Mist in Fresh Watermelon and Sugar. So really cute. Grab those as gifts. I found these and they're new. They're Be Pure Concentrated Facial Serum, Niacinamide. Helps skin appear brighter, easily applies to your skin, helps dark spots appear less noticeable, and it aids to moisture the skin. You get 10 little pods in here, and let me show you what I mean by pods. They're packaged like the little vitamin C capsules. So you just like squeeze it and take off the top, and then you put the stuff on your skin and then wipe it in. But niacinamide is amazing for your skin, you guys. If that's what this is, I mean, if that's true, this is going to be real nice. So yeah, super excited about that. I will let you guys know. I got one for myself. I got one for a gift. But yeah, we will give it a try. Super excited with the stuff that they are coming out with. I grabbed another one of these um, Duo Eyeshadow by LA Colors. This one is in Better Half, and I just really thought the color was pretty. I got it as a gift. Okay, and then this was also really new, and it is a lavender scented warming eye mask. Self warming. Enjoy up to 20 minutes of relaxation. You get one in here. It says to remove any contact lenses and makeup. Um, you must use it immediately after removing it. Removing it, removing, removing it from the packaging. It says once you're exposed to the air, once it exposed to the air, it starts to heat up. Place it over your closed eyes with the pattern side facing out and wait for one minute for eye mask to warm up. Relax and enjoy the warmth and calming lavender scent. Yeah, how great does that sound? I mean, how fantastic and how pretty is this? Super cool for Mother's Day, right? 
You could do your mom a whole relaxing little little gift basket. You could throw in the cute little I love you mom trinket tray. You could do a little bit. I mean, that would be so, so cute. So yeah, yeah. Keep these in mind. I'm going to try them and I'll let you guys know in my next product review or empties video. We will see. Okay, the last two things. I picked up both of these for the same reason, but at different trips. So the first one I bought at the first trip and I just needed something to hold back my hair while I was doing my makeup. So I figured these would be perfect for that because they have one side that's like a fabric side, you know? So it won't make it, you know, like it won't make an indentation because it's got the fabric side. So I figured those would be perfect for it, you know? So I grabbed those. Then I saw these and these are actually the ones that are like marketed. They look exactly like the ones that you would buy on Amazon or at Target or any beauty supply store. And they're actually so cute. And so these are the ones that I ended up getting to hold my hair back. They're these little four pieces of these little hairpins and they're just a little alligator clip and they have like a little plastic part on it. But isn't that cute? I don't know. I think they're cute. I think they're pretty. I think they're pretty colors and they're kind of glittery. So, so yeah, so I ended up with two sets of snaps, but I'll use them both. So, or I will give this one as a gift or to my sister or something for while she's doing her makeup or I don't know, my best friend, something like that. But yeah, so I grabbed two things of clips to hold back my hair. Oh my goodness, we did it. Wow, that took a long time, you guys. I apologize. I appreciate all of that you all of you i appreciate all of you that stuck around to the end please leave me a comment below let me know what you guys are doing for easter i hope that you have a wonderful day tomorrow and yeah i have an empties coming up because that bag is getting really full because i haven't done it now in over a month so yeah we're getting really really full there and um yeah anyway guys thank you again so much for being here i really appreciate you I'm so happy to be back Um, hopefully I won't have any more, you know, um, weeks where I have to be gone because I, you know, that it was terrible being gone, you know, and not being able to film videos, but it was worse on my heart because I was so worried about my, my grandma, you know, I mean, it was just, it was a awful few weeks. So, so excited to be back. So excited that that worry is behind me a little bit now and that we're in the healing process. So. Anyways, guys, sorry I rambled a lot through this video. Like I said, my first video back and I'm just really excited to be talking to you guys. So anyways, I hope that you're all doing fantastic again. And until the next time that I see you, take care.